Good afternoon, Southwest Flora. I'm Paige Godfrey. This Naples Herald lunch break is sponsored by Conditioned Air, the comfort people since 1962. This afternoon, we'll tell you about spring training being shortened next year, Trump plans to announce a Supreme Court pick next month, and more. Today is Wednesday, January 25th, and this is the lunch break. For everyone who thinks spring training is too long, help is on the way. A little, anyways. Spring training will be shortened by two days starting in 2018 when new restrictions in Major League Baseball's collective bargaining agreement take effect on game times for regular season getaway days. The voluntary reporting date for pitchers, catchers, and injured players will be 43 days before the Major League opener instead of 45, according to a copy of the agreement obtained by the Associated Press. For other players, the date will be 38 days ahead instead of 40. President Donald Trump said Wednesday he intends to announce his nominee for the Supreme Court on February 2nd, and three federal appeals court judges are said to be the front runners to fill the lifetime seat held by the late Justice Antonin Scalia, a conservative icon. You can read about it at NaplesHerald.com. Plans to reintroduce Conservation Collier, a land acquisition and preservation initiative by the county, will not go to a public referendum, the Board of County Commissioners decided on Tuesday. Instead, the county will poll for public support of the measure and a potential property tax increase to fund it before deciding whether to reauthorize the program as early as the start of the next fiscal year. And that was Lunch Break for today. I'm Paige Godfrey. The Lunch Break airs Monday through Friday at 12 p.m. right here at NaplesHerald.com. And don't forget to check out our morning report that also airs Monday through Friday at 9 a.m. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you tomorrow.